Hey everybody, Fresh Reviews here. Welcome to the epic finale of our Let's Play of Lego Dimensions. In the last part, we took on the Try, which was a giant version of Metal Beard, but with a combination between uh, Frodo and Robin. Robin. And yeah. Robin. Now we'll be taking on the final level and dealing with Lord Vortec one last oh. time. Also, hey guys, it's the Can Man here. Yeah. I just want to say thank you guys so much for including me on your LP. It's been a lot of fun. Yeah. And I just feel, I just think back to what it was like, wow, that was just been a fun journey and all yeah, right. It's such a it's to come to an end. There's always more LPs I can go commentate. This is it. The final blow. And we're still in the, in the, uh, the dimension that we haven't, uh, there's no level yet. I mean, we're in, the, he's in the, he's in his giant form, and we're trying to collect stuff first. So is the level starting? Yeah, it started, yeah. So what do you do? Because I've never played this level. You pretty much have to collect keystone pieces, and then, uh, you try to land on, on, uh, his body. Oh, okay. How long is this level? Like 30 minutes. Oh my gosh. What do you think of Lord of Vortech as a villain? I think he's pretty cool. As a yeah. villain. Yeah. But well, well, what like no did in the time they had to come on with, I think they did a pretty good job. Yeah. Alright. Alright, we're on the top part of his armor. And. Is there like other stuff from like other properties in here? Like, does there anything. Cameo? Um, I mean, the uh, DeLorean appeared at one point. Oh, nice. In this level, nice. Yeah, in this level, yeah. More of uh, Lord Vortex Cosmic Minions are also appearing, also. Alright. Yeah, alright. Yeah. I wish I gave you an origin story of Lord Vortex. Like, how how can he do all this? <coughs> hmm. You know, I wish they made a Lego Dimensions movie, but have it be like in like like live action. That would be pretty dope. <laughs> yeah. Like, have it not be Lego and just call Dimension Collide. That would that would make a lot of money. Yeah. Would it be possible? I don't know, but. <clears throat> Even a Lego Dimensions movie. Yeah. Oh, uh, can I sport? Are you gonna see the Lego Batman movies? I, I want to sport. I have not. I, I have not yet seen it yet. Are you planning? I'm planning on it? it, yeah. Hopefully. Uh, I want to spoil something, but I won't say it. And yeah, it's once you see it in a movie. I, I don't want to say it. Okay, I won't. Yeah. I've actually guys never played this level. Um, I've never. Played all the levels in this game as I've stated it before, but so this is the last episode. How did we even? I forgot. How did this even come up to you, a co-commentary? Uh, hmm. I actually don't know. I think was that my because I thought you said oh, you've been doing dimensions. I'm like, oh, that'll yeah, be cool. Yeah. Yeah. And then I said, can we do? Yeah. The only other videos we've done is that uh, I don't even know we did co-commentary on Lego Batman Three. Yeah. And then also, we did a discussion beyond Galaxy 3 of Sunshine 2. Yeah. And then you interviewed me, so yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, now the other side. <coughs> it's kind of nice to do co commentary in a game like Lego Dimensions since they, all, all the levels are, you know, lengthy. Yeah. You know, it's kind of. It's a robot now. Wait. Alright, there's a lot of stuff here. Build. This thing over here. Yeah. And boom. Alright. Now I have to deal with more enemies. Alright. Oh yeah. Now I guess I have also have to switch to Gandalf. Oh, alright, not right now. I have to deal with a bunch of those Lego movie. Cops, alright, there we go. Uh yeah, now I'm switching to Gandalf. Moving this thing, blowing that up, and start building they're trying to, to, to destroy, uh, we're trying to hit Lord Vortec. Alright, let's gotta move this platform here. 
Have you ever seen the movie, uh, Lego and the Adventures of Clutch Pass? Have you ever seen that movie? Uh, no, I have not, no. Okay, well, it, was a, it was a straight to DVD video, basically, and I said it's not that good. But... Yeah. <laughs> easily, easily, the Lego movie's a lot, a lot better. Yeah. Now throw that. Alright. Wait. Um. Jeez. That guy. Alright, and this robot has one more hit. Oh, yeah. Alright. Now I need to build a ramp to destroy this thing. So, pretty much. Should probably so pull out the battlefield. You fight one World Tech, we fight in the back to the future level. Yeah. You fight him in we do correct? Yeah. I mean, he was that. Yeah, he was that mummy dude, and then. Yeah, yeah. Um, the and prime. Then you fight him. Yeah. Level, yeah. Level you fight him about four times. Yeah. And. Alright. There's the other one. Go ahead and destroy that dude. Alright. Now. Pushing this one to take they, down. They should do like they should do Disney dimensions and have like all the Disney villains come together, like have Darth Vader, Maleficent, Loki. Yeah. This is kind of like the Warner Brothers version. All right. I need to collect seven Keystone things, man. Have you ever 100 percented a game? Uh... Yes. What? Have you... Uh, which one? Uh... Complete the first LEGO Star Wars game. Then LEGO Star Wars 2, then... <laughs> LEGO Star... LEGO Indiana Jones. Almost completed LEGO Batman. I've actually 100 percented LEGO Batman 2. Lego Batman 2 is not, not a difficult game. I think I 100 percent complete that one and uh, also maybe Lego Indiana Jones 2. This game, this game seems very hard to 100 percent. We have yeah. to pay for half of it. Yep. Just kind of dumb. Uh, what do you think? The well, we've said that the game we, itself is overpriced. Do you think the Fun packs overpriced for the team packs or the level packs? Yeah, they are a bit overpriced, yeah. How much are the fun packs? Are, I think the level packs. The level packs, you get a character, a level, and then two vehicles, it's $30. I think that should be like 25 and the team packs are 20 which I don't know. Yeah. I mean, again, you're getting the figure in the game and in real life to use as a, like, a minifigure. And most of these are not in Lego sets, but still, I don't know. Yeah. Oh god. Wasn't there like that Back to the Future set a couple years ago? Yeah. Wasn't it like fan submitted? It was, yeah, because it was a uh, Lego Kickstarter thing. Oh my god, Bane! Bane? Yeah. Um, right on, right on World Vortex. Say, yeah. Oh, all right. There's. So yeah, I guess he has to destroy these things. Well, I guess we have to. Yep. There we go. Got one hit, out, babe. It's becoming big. All right. All right. Now I guess I have to get him to go to one of these ones over here. All right. All right. There we go. Yes. You shrunk. Don't take steroids, Bane. Oh. Don't cheat. You're cheating. All right. Well, at least he has one more hit anyway. Just have to hit him. All right, come on. Boom. All right, he's got it. Jeez. Oh my God. Are you invincible, Bane? I can't even. There we go. Hey, it's going back into the portal. Boom. Alright, there's, there's one. We have to do three, so that's one down. Three to go. Alright, just gonna move this one. 
Alright, that's one down. One down, two to go. Now I have to build the other one. Alright. Uh, and, and that's called a Hufu Bang. Yeah. Let's come all the DC boss fights. You had the Joker in the Simpson level, you had Lex Luthor and Jago. Yeah. You had the Ritterer and Lord of the Rings. You also had Brainiac in the Lord of the Rings, and you have General Zod in Ghostbusters. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> What was your thoughts on the boss fights in this game? I mean... They were... Good. So that some of them were a bit ridiculous. Yeah. Like, but ridiculous in a good way, you know? Yeah. Now, not every LP you do is code commentary, correct? Yeah. Okay. I'm surprised you didn't have me on for the LEGO Bionicle games. But I know you're doing those with someone else. Yeah. Oh, that's one phase, and there's the doctor. Oh, it's cutscene. Right. He's gonna give him the push. I think we're going into his dimension. Who's? Lord Vortex. Uh -huh. Back to the prime dimension. I think. Who's dim what dimension are you in now? It's a uh, Lord Vortex. But what, what dimension were you were you in before that? It was in the uh, the 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 travel where before you enter a dimension. Oh, the loading screen. Yeah. <laughs> All right, phase two. Now inside of his actual dimension, his actual world. Like, what, who, who is Lone Vortex? I wish they told us more about him. Yeah. Ugh. Like, is he, uh, is he, uh... I mean, what, like, how did he come to be? How does he have his... You know what would be cool? Like, I mentioned TV show, that would be nice. Yeah. Just for... Alright. Time for... Puzzling. Giant abomination. Alright, another thing to build here with wild style. Alright, oh, we're just gonna avoid. <laughs> Alright, it's another puzzle thing, so it's probably gonna be a, a paint one, probably. Or, I don't know. Yeah, probably the paint one or the elemental. I have to still have to deal with these guys while doing master builds. Alright, yeah. Boom! Alright, no idea what that is. Alright. Well, it's a thing for the puzzle, so it's probably either a big old, a big old bomb or something. I have no idea. Alright. Doing this. And then I have to build... Is Vortex giant? Yeah, he's giant. Mm. Interesting. Yeah. Alright. Um, let's see. Hit that. Alright, portals. Alright. Let's see. Purple one. Wait, probably. Yeah. Alright. Wait. Yes. There we go. Now I need to assemble this thing. Oh, it's just part of that ramping thing. Okay. So I guess now. Oh. Oops. I still need for Batman somewhere. Alright, now he's back. Alright, boom. I think this game, one thing what it is, is, is I hate moving the characters on the different areas on the base. Yeah. I, I downright hate that. I I hate it. I, I I it's annoying, it's obnoxious, you have to move them like every two seconds. So if Amiibo scouring isn't Disney fit, it's just kind of a one-tap deal. Yeah. I mean, you don't have to tap multiple times. Why? It's... Uh, and especially, like, on... Like, the, these past two levels, where it's, like, all these puzzles and these boss fights, you know, and... Uh, it's just... <clears throat> but uh, what, what's Vortec doing now? He isn't, he isn't doing anything yet. We destroyed some of the foundation, the whole foundation, the full version of the, the, the foundation of element of dimensions. 
Which is the base plate? Yeah, which is the base plate. Oh, I get foundation base plate. Yep. <laughs> like you. <laughs> That's one thing Lego's always been good at is their humor. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's one thing I've enjoyed about them. Alright, and that's... All right, it's time for... Oh, some sort of... Does it makes sense, you know? Yeah. <laughs> that's so funny. Alright. Alright, what am I supposed to do over here? Am I supposed to search something over here? It seems kind of... Oh, right. This type of puzzle deal. Alright, move that right there. And, well, that was just easy peasy. Alright, now I need to shrink Gandalf. And bring him to over here. From this platform. Alright, there we go. And now, we'll just... Oh, uh, yeah, I guess we'll just shrink Wildstyle, I guess. Yeah. Alright. And then, pressing that button. Jeez, man. Alright, another cosmic dude. Alright, boom. Alright. So wait, what LP is after this? I told you, it was Legend of the Bro Fist. Uh, what's after that? Uh... Probably... Uh, another Kirby game. <laughs> You like Kirby games a lot. Yeah. I have literally no idea what to do with uh, this. Alright. The Earth element. Alright, Wes is doing now. Oh, there's gigantic pocket cubes. Don't need that. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, search. Right, forgot. Searching, searching. There we go. Big old portal. It's a Dalek. Of course. Hey, what is he gonna do? Yep, he's throwing some of the, the another piece uh, almost. Yeah, another piece of the of the of the giant green base play is destroyed. There's only two more left. <laughs> this is so funny. Yeah, but oh, oh, that's just oh, because you don't expect it. You know, I know what this is gonna. Yeah. Alright. What's uh Alright, we just now did that. Alright, so I guess we'll head over here, I guess. Alright. Oh, there's something over here. Yeah. The fire emblem. I need to melt some stuff though before that. Take out that guy. Take out that cosmic dude. Yeah. Alright, now we just got a wall jump. Yeah. Sorry, how how long do you have LPs planned out to? Uh, I would say probably to planned out throughout the entire year. Oh wow! Yeah. Wow. What's how many LPs are left? You don't have to name them. I really don't know. That's not amazing how you can play them now. Yeah. Right, well then you also have your... Do you have an upload schedule? I do have an upload schedule. What is it? I mean, I just post videos daily. That's uh, pretty is much it my... Isn't Mario Kart Saturday? Yeah, Mario... It, yeah, usually Saturdays are usually Mario Kart and... GTA. And other stuff. Uh, the most of, and then during the week it's LPs. Yeah, during the weekdays are LPs. Yeah, that's, that's what I was thinking, but I just wanted to make sure. Yeah. So this, okay, so this LP is going to be finished in about two or three weeks. Yeah. Since it, yeah. This is fifth parts and fourth, just, yeah. Yeah, so. It's kind of nice. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm assuming this last play is probably going to be done, uh, hopefully. I can tell it's probably going to be done like around. April or around at the end of either the end of April or the beginning of May probably. 
Nice. All right. Oh, my birthday is actually a, my birthday is actually April twenty fifth. That would be cool if one video released on my birthday. Yeah. For me, I, I personally don't have an upload schedule because I feel like the thing with upload schedules, like, if you don't upload on that day, then people get angry just for me. Like, yeah. I actually tried to when I, when I, like, a year ago, we just never really worked out. It's kind of how I upload, I upload. But I don't know what, like, I might see a movie that I'm not playing. Yeah. You really don't know the predictability. Yeah. What about... Oh, I guess that's... Oh, yeah, I have to rebuild now. Alright, there we go. Boom. Alright. Go. Alright. Boom. It's charging another dimension portal, which is summoning GLaDOS. Ah, oh, I thought GLaDOS was helping us. Well, she is, yeah. She just summoned, like, a giant missile thing, destroying the last foundation green base plate. So, yep. It's destroyed. Nice. Now you have to take on Vortech, I take it. Yeah. Phase 3! Oh my Are you still here? Yeah, I'm, I'm just watching the cutscene. Alright, now it's done. Oh, it's a cutscene? Alright. Phase oh, I really enjoy... I really enjoy your GTA videos. They're a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, this is probably the final phase. Yep, the final phase for the yeah, battle. Is that post commentary the GTA ones are now? No, they're live commentary, just like uh, the Mario Kart Online videos. Oh, huh. but your LPs are post. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, the, yeah, the GTA, the, the GTA Mario Kart ones are really, I'll say probably some of your best. Oh, he's so the big stuff. All right. Okay. Well, one thing is like the GTA videos have like different people than the Mario Kart like, videos. You know? Yeah. It's not the same group of people. Yeah. Alright, boom. Alright, gotta pull this thing. This is probably a ramp of some sort. Yes, it is. Alright, need to summon the boom and go ahead again. Alright. There we go. Boom! Right into his face. Alright. That's one hit. Oh, there's a giant portal in the background. So I think probably what the what we're supposed to do is try to keep hitting him until like a massive portal comes straight to him. Oh, he's table flipping. He's table no. He's flipping the platform. He's trying to flip us. That's why I'm mashing the button. All right, there we go. I've actually never seen the end cutscene this game, so I don't know how this game ends. Yeah. Oh, he's shooting lasers again. Alright, 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 alright. Just gotta keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. Alright, come on. There's something all the way over there. Oh, bro, so mo oh more stuff from uh, Cuckoo Land and the. Uh, I forget recall what was the other one. <laughs> alright. Alright. Oh yeah, Cloud Cuckoo Land and Portal. Right, yeah. Shooting fireworks at his face. That's another hit. But well, speaking of crossover game stories, what well, what was your thoughts on the So Space Emissary? Um I liked it. I mean it was like the I it's like the only campaign there is for uh, Smash Bros. Brawl. Yeah, I thought I thought it was okay personally. Yeah. No, I love it. No, I thought it was fine for what it is. 
I don't think I like as much as I do. Some of the levels are kind of boring, like Savannah, Forest, I'm like, I would just give it like a the Forest Farm, you know, blank game, or... Yeah. You know, you know what I mean? At least give it some... You know, War some of those like that, yeah, like the castle from Final Run, but still is... I think what people really look forward to is the interaction, I feel like. You know. Yeah. Oh, what? Uh, oh. How much time is left in this level? Um. I don't know. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to master build right now <laughs> to do something to, to hit. I really like the tech. master building thing, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. Square, 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 shooting a laser at his face, yeah! Hopefully another, yep. I think that might be it, because there's now three portals. Yep, that's it. Yep. We did it. Is that there? Yep, he's defeated. <laughs> Woo! Nice job. Yep. Friends, we, we did it. The doctor is from here. The, from, from the wicked from the wicked witch to Lord Vortex, we did it. Yep. Okay, I need to tie up that well, so I guess this is big cutscene. Yeah, it's cutscene. And you need to stand just there. Good. Hold this. Is there anything we can do? What's happening? Well, the doctor gave Gandalf Wild Style and Batman stuff to try to to uh, get to throw the things at Lord Vortech. Yeah, that would be funny if this was just all a dream. <laughs> Batman wakes up. Oh, what? <laughs> But like, like if this was a genie and Batman wakes up and he's like, oh, this is all gene, but then like, like you see like Scooby Doo run past, so like, was it a gene? That would have been cool. They threw a twist and then did them. Um, yeah, but there's two. Yeah. It's been removed from the reality. So, does Lord Vortech die, or does he just get defeated? No, he's just trapped for the rest of time. So, like, basically, General Zod. Pretty much. Nice. The final dimension. So, what do you give this level and this game out of 10? Well, for the game, probably about a 9. Really? How about this level? This level... About an 8. How about the last level? The final boss one? Will you give that one out to him? Probably... No, the end of... End of try, I mean. Um... Probably about an 8. Alright. Okay, well, Time to same. finish the story. Lego Dimensions. <gasps> GLaDOS! And the credits are rolling. So that was it. That's Lego well, Dimensions. It's... Woof. I, I, I'm gonna give the game an 8.5 of 10. I mean... There are a lot of downsides to it, but ultimately, I think just the idea and like when this game is good, it's really good. Yeah. Like yes, moving the figures is annoying. Some of the things are not best. Some of the levels are not the best. But overall, I think it's a very fun game. The story mode is good. I'll probably give the story mode a seven point five out of ten personally. 
I'll give the game an 8.5 out of 10. I think some of the levels from the level packs are really well done, like Ghostbusters. The Midway Arcade is really fun. Uh, the hubs are really fun, and the characters, like, when they interact, it's funny, so... Thanks for having me on, and hopefully there's a game we can do co-commentary in the yeah. future, whatever. I mean... Yeah. Yeah. And the start of the of this credits is actually is, is actually another uh, original portal song, but it's for it's mainly for this game actually. Oh nice. Yeah, for this credit sequence. Nice. Are you gonna go through the whole entire credits or did you? Yeah, skip through, them? I'm gonna go through the whole entire credits. <laughs> oh nice. Well, it's been fun doing this. You know, uh, nice doing this. And also, guys, um. Tomorrow, actually, or I don't know. Whenever, okay. If I'm probably gonna upload it by now, if I haven't, go check out my channel. Me and Fred's actually gonna do a discussion on the Lego games. Um, it's not gonna be long. It's probably gonna be like 10, 15-ish minutes. But basically, listing some of my favorite and least favorite games in the franchise. So that will be on my channel. Also, on my channel, I've done some Dimension videos. I think only like five, or, but I've done a good amount. Yeah. So you just wanna head over and check that out. Yeah. Well, I'm glad we got to do this. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Are you gonna rebuy Dimensions for the Wii U since... Uh, are you just gonna... Nah. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think it's just... Oh, okay. I, don't, I don't think it's a wor worth a rebuy. <laughs> really? Yeah. But, but you got all those figure packs. Yeah. I mean, I got them just do this because they were on sale at the doll 99 cent store. Oh, okay, okay. So, yeah. They're mainly collection value. So, um, yeah. they're for, mainly for collection, pretty much. But, uh, yeah. Uh, like as always, uh, the next uh, Let's Play uh, that I'm not going to announce, uh, but it will be revealed. In, in in the uh, next announcement video, so yeah. So I guess I'm not yeah, necessarily cool. really. Uh, overall, I really enjoy this game. Overall, it's, it's like one of those best crossover games. I mean, there were uh, yeah some <laughs> least favorite levels. Oh, there's part one of the credits. There's another. When it comes to crossovers, I'll say this is up with Smash. Yeah. Like, I think Smash is a better game, but I think for crossover, I think, well, let me exp I think for crossover idea and executed, I think this is the best crossover game. I think Smash is the better game gameplay wise, but in Smash, really, in all honesty, you re the characters don't really interact, to be honest. Yeah. In this game, characters say stuff to each other. Not every character, but some characters do. I'll say this is, I think Smash is a better game overall. I think this is up there. Um, have you ever played Marvel vs. Capcom? Because I know that's a really... I have played the, uh, second one. Oh, really? Did, did you enjoy it? Yeah! A tiny bit, yeah. Nice, I heard that's a, that's a unique crossover too. Having Marvel and Capcom, and, uh... This is a, this is like such a weird crossover that works. You know, to have Sonic, Batman, you know, Peter Bankman and like Monty McFly and Sting game, it's just crazy, you know. Yeah. I think this game could have been a big mess, but the Lego team handled it so well. Are you gonna do a, a Lego City Undercover? What's the point of you already done one? Uh I am planning on doing the Lego City Undercover game. When that comes nice. out, uh on the PS4, but it does comes out in April, though. It comes out on the 11th, so, yeah. Does it come out on the Switch? Yeah, it's coming out on the Switch oh, and the April PS4 coming? and oh, April Xbox 11? Oh, I thought, One. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, I thought it came out a lot. Oh, wow. Okay, nice. I'm gonna pick that up on the Switch. Probably most likely do cut maybe some videos on there. But that game looks... Right. And then, they're releasing Chase McCain pack, correct? Yeah, they are releasing a Chase McCain pack for Lego Dimensions, yeah. Is it fun pack? Um... Yeah, I think so. That's just sweet to have the fun pack. 
Is that one of the last packs released? Um, I don't know. There's like other ones, but I forgot what were the other the other ones were. Cause I know like the ETs out, Sonics out, stuff like that's out. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm just trying to remember. You know. If. Yeah, I'm trying to remember too. Is that mentioned in this year? Is that a rumor? I think it's probably just a rumor, I guess. Do you, do you think it should end? I guess is the correct question. Not do you want it? Do you think it should? I, I, yeah, I believe so, yeah. Oh, okay. I mean, it's had a good run. Yeah. Uh, kind of. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's had some ups and downs, but you not know, every game does, so... I just, I really wish this game was more successful. Not because I like Legos, but just to show like, wacky crossovers work, like, like this works, you know? Yeah. I mean, this is a very creative game, like, what some of the characters say to each other is actually really creative, you know? Yeah. In all honesty, um... So, yeah, I, I think it's, you know, really, I just hope, I know LEGO games have always been fun, so. Are the credits still going? They're still going. So what are your top five favorite themes, themes in this game? Well, one of them is Ninjago, and the other one was, uh, Doctor Who, and, uh, How about other three? Not levels, but just kind of themes overall. Um. How about Portal? Portal. Back to the Future, was that one? Mm. I'm trying to just, uh, Simpsons is a Lord of the Rings level. Yeah. Um. Uh, for me personally, it's uh. For me, top five, I like Scooby Doo, Ghostbusters. I really love the level pack and the. Uh, Get your level in the story mode. Um, I like Jurassic Park. I also like the Lego movie. The Lego movie's hub is really fantastic, so. Yeah, but, uh. How, how much is left of the credits? Probably, probably about two more minutes. How about, uh, do you mind if I plug my channel real quick? Yeah, sure, I guess. Oh, thanks. If you guys have enjoyed my commentary, check out my channel. I do LPs, not as much as... I do a lot of gaming videos. I do actually a lot of stuff. I do movie reviews, TV show reviews, not them. I kind of do a variety. I do some TV show and movie reviews. Uh, I also do uh, cooking videos. I do Lego Star Motions. I do rap battles. I do Smash Family Trailers. I do gaming videos. I do a lot, so if you kind of want a variety of things, uh, checking out Tan Man C, and if you guys enjoy the commentary, thanks. Um, I've done some Dimension videos. I would suggest you watching the Ghostbusters Lolo Pack review. That's like a thousand views on my channel. Um, so, yeah, but anyways, uh, thanks for having me on. It's been a lot of, really a lot of fun, and through the, all the tough and fun times. Yeah. Well, it's not really been tough, but... <laughs> well, anyway, yeah. Um... I guess, uh, I guess I'll see you guys when I start my next Let's Play. So, yeah. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.